Hi friends, it is a simplified structure of chromosome and chromatid. And first we have to see uh, with respect to morphology of chromosomes and which are the parts uh, coming, uh, which are occurring in these chromosomes are centromere, chromomere, chromonemata, matrix, pellicle, and uh, we can find this telomere. Telomere means the end part of the chromatids or chromosomes are called as telomere and coming to coming to uh, centromere the region of chromosome which uh, spindle fibers attach during the metaphase are known as centromere in this place the uh, uh, in this place in this place uh, Uh, see in this place, it's a centromere where uh, uh, spindle fibers are attached like this. Uh, spindle fibers are attached like this, like this, and separation occurs during metaphase stage. And uh, centromeres are also called as a primary constriction or kinetochore. And as you know that a centromere has uh, four important uh, functions are there: orientation of chromosomes at a metaphase and uh, formation of uh, chromatids, chromosome shape and movement of chromosomes during anaphase. These are the important functions of uh, centromere that are of course uh, that, uh, that present in chromosome. Coming to the uh, chromatid, what do you mean by chromatid? It's one of the two cr distinct longitudinal subunits of a chromosome. These are called as uh, chromatids as you can see here chromatids. This one and uh, this is two, two chromatids are there and uh, we can see that uh, the, the two types of uh, chromatids are two types sister chromatids and non sister chromatids and in this uh, sister chromatids are the which are derived from the one chromatid like this in this this one chromosome is simply replicated here this one chromosome, this one chromosome or this two chromosome, which is uh, one chromosome is replicated from the second chromosome, like simply mentioning uh, or you can say B, take B, B chromatid, and in this uh, B chromatid is replicated from the A chromatid. It's called a uh, sister chromatid. With respect to uh, what do you call non-sister chromatid, between two chromosomes. These two are called as non sister chromatids. These are all called as these two are called as sister chromatid, like sister chromatids. These are non non sister chromatids. And uh, coming to this constriction, we can we find some secondary constriction. The constricted or narrow region other than the centromere is called as primary constriction. This one is. Uh, primary constriction other than the primary constriction where we find the narrow region is called as a secondary constriction it is usually found in the short arm of the chromosome which is, which is, short, which is short in that region the secondary constriction is found, found. and uh, we can find types of chromosomes like a sat chromosome or satellite chromosome what does it mean the chromosome with the secondary constriction is referred as a satellite chromosomes or sat chromosomes and the sat chromosomes are associated with the nucleolar organizer and coming to a telomere a terminal region of the chromosomes on either side is known as telomere and uh, telomeres are uh, usually stable and uh, if they cut means they become unstable and joins together they are usually stable and do not do not fuse do not fuse if they are cut then they will fuse each other and form circle like appearance circle and then uh, chromomeres chromomeres are linearly arranged bead like structure found on the chromosomes are known as chromomeres see we can see here bead like structure see like this we can see here bead like structures and 
these these are called as uh, chromomeres and uh, and it is clearly visible in the polytim chromosomes and uh, and available evidence indicate that the centromere represent a unit of dna replication chromosome coiling and rna synthesis and rna processing and coming back to uh, chroma nima and uh, under light microscope thread like coiled structure are found in the chromosomes and chromatids which are called as chroma nima and plural form of chroma nima is chroma nimata chroma nima is considered to be associated with three main functions and it controls the size of the chromosome because uh, uh, its coiled like structure is found in chromosome see here you can say uh, structure and uh, it uh, main function is the control the size of chromosomes as it is a duplication of the chromosomes and uh, gene bearing portion of the chromosome chromonema is a structure of subunit of sub chromatid nature chromonema is a structure of sub chromatid nature and coming to matrix mass of a chromatic material in which chromonema chroma nimata are embedded is called as matrix where the chroma nimata this chroma nimata which is embedded which present inside the matrix like it's inside these are present inside the matrix this chroma nimata this is chroma nimata and uh, matrix the jelly like uh, substance which is present is called as a matrix and come to uh, and the matrix which is enclosed by sheath which is known as pellicle the cell structure we can see that the structure of the covering sheath is known as a pellicle see so you can see structure here it is pellicle pellicle and both matrix and pellicle are non genetic material it is very important that uh, matrix and pellicle are non genetic materials which is which are present in the uh, chromosomes Thank you guys this is the simplified structure of uh, chromosomes and chromatids if you like the video please comment and share with your friends and if you wish any video that can be done if you have any doubt please comment below which section you want uh, some videos let us know we'll make sure to reach that video at proper manner easy and understanding way please subscribe our channel thank you